Do you know why our wounds form a scab? What do we do when we're bleeding? Don't worry, they've got it covered. <gasps> Whenever our blood vessels are damaged, platelets quickly gather at the wound. They block the hole like a stopper in a pipe, using their bodies to seal the wound, to stop the blood from escaping. That's amazing! Here come the white blood cells. White blood cells are our body's cleanup crew. They can clear out bacteria that sneak in, preventing secondary infections. They also monitor the health of our cells and identify abnormal or mutated cells. This one is infected! Take it away, discard it! Once the body has stopped the bleeding and cleaned up, it's the repair crew's turn to step in. Fibroblasts are our body's repair workers. They produce collagen to fill the wound, like bricks on a construction site, helping to repair our injured skin wall. Repair! Repair! Repair complete! But sometimes these workers try too hard and produce too much collagen. Just like construction workers using too much cement, the wall becomes very thick and rough. This is what causes a scab. So, will this scab stay there forever? Of course not! Over time, the edges of the scab will gradually soften and get itchy, like it will naturally fall off after a while. Do you have a habit of picking at your scabs? Share your thoughts in the comments so everyone can know.